All right, as you guys know, I haven't done football finger food in a long time. And I gotta tell you, I feel like football's back to normal again. I feel like we're playing real football. Politics is gone. Uh, personal opinions are gone and we're watching and enjoying the game once again. Same with baseball, same with hockey, same with everything. So I'm bringing a, a football finger food for you because literally in one hour, okay, I'm going to be watching the Michigan-Wisconsin game uh, on the TV. I got it up there right now. Uh, it is a Saturday. We're doing a whole bunch of college football today and I need a snack. So we're going to be doing a football finger food and they're kind of called pizza rolls. Okay, and come on in close. I'll show you how to make it. They're, they look super easy. So hopefully I can make it before the game starts in an hour. Okay, uh, bring it on in and we'll get this thing started. Okay, if I said we're under um, under the gun, we basically have one hour to get this made, okay? So we're gonna get this started. All you need is some pizza sauce. Some, you can either do the store-bought cheese or the high-end uh, cheese, whichever cheese you want. We need mozzarella slices, okay? I bought it pre-sliced. You can slice your own if you want. I don't have time for that. I'm a lazy guy. And you got your pepperoni right here, okay? So let me go get the cookie sheet and we'll start laying it out. All right, so I've laid out 12 slices of cheese. Um, it's interesting because the store brand's a little bit thinner and the video that I got this idea from, they use the store brand. So if for some reason this doesn't work, I'm blaming it that I didn't use the store brand. Only one slice is the store brand. I can't remember which one is this one right here. The cheese is a little bit thinner. Who knows? I get all scientific on this. Okay, we're going to put pepperoni on each slice. We're putting four pieces. Make sure it's in. I don't know if they can touch. I didn't really pay attention too much. I just know this is the, the basics for all that. Let's see. Okay, do this with every slice. Do four pieces. All right, here we go. Took 10 minutes to lay it out. Once again, bake at 400 for six minutes. Then pull it out and meet me back here, okay? All right, so while that's in the oven, we're gonna take our our sauce. Just dump that in a bowl. We're gonna heat that up. Mm -hmm. No, I didn't lick the edge of the jar, I swear. No, you didn't just see me lick the edge of the jar. This Rayo's homemade sauce is just amazing. They're not a sponsor or anything, but I have to tell you, man, that arrabbiata is my favorite spicy it's really good all right let's heat it up i didn't see how long you cool it for didn't tell me the directions but i'm gonna let those cool i'm gonna check the the recipe one more time i think this is it let them cool for a few minutes so that we can alter them as needed okay i forgot one step i just realized we gotta season these. Where's my Italian seasoning? All right, just pulled them out of the hub oven, letting them cool for a minute before I try to finish up what I need to do. But I'm gonna hit them with a little bit of Italian seasoning, each one, a little sprinkle. Give it that Italian flair. There we go. That's what you want. If you can do that, you're ready to go to the next step. Now you're gonna take this and you're gonna give it a roll. And you're 
And as they cool, you're going to want to roll each one. Slide it over there. Grab the next one. We're going to have to cut them. So grab another one. Bring it over. Lay it out. Fix it if it folds under. Give it a roll. There we go. Give it another one. Oops. This guy's sticking everybody. Come on, stop it. Get off everybody's case. Here we go. Lay it out. Give it a roll. There we go. Grab another one. Get down here. All right, now that they've cooled a little bit, go ahead and take one roll. Just stab it in the sauce like that. Let's give that a try. That lovely marinara sauce already warm. Mmm. Mmm. This is going to be a hit. This tastes just like pizza. Took me 10 minutes to make it. 6 minutes to cook it. Another 10 minutes to roll it. Now they're all cooled off. They're all solid. They're not going to melt together. Here we go. I'm going to take this inside and I will see you guys after the game. All right. Take care.